Welcome to Library Make, brought to you by the Plano Public Library System, where we'll show you how to make some fun literacy activities that we use right here at the library in Storytime. My name is Alyssa, and today I'll be teaching you how to make your very own Shapes flannel set. Learning shapes is a great way for kids to start recognizing shapes and then start recognizing letters, and it's a key skill on the way to reading. Today's activity will be a flannel titled Green Square, Green Square, and it's best suited for babies and toddlers. To make this flannel set, you'll need several pieces of felt fabric, one of which definitely needs to be green, as well as other basic colors. We went with red, orange, pink, purple, yellow, and blue, but you can choose whatever you'd like. Next, you'll need some scissors, a pencil, glue, paper, and optionally, some little magnets. First decide which shapes you're going to match with which colors of felt fabric. Although if you're making our flannel set, be sure you match your square with your green felt. Start tracing your shapes onto your felt fabric. Or for the more adventuresome, skip the tracing and start cutting freestyle. I think I'll go with the tracing first. Once you're done tracing, or not, it's time to start cutting. This job is reserved for adults only, so be careful. Awesome! Now you have your very own green square, green square flannel set. Since felt is great on most cloth surfaces, this will be excellent for play on a rug or carpet. If you don't want to get down on the rug, this is where your magnets and your glue come in. Just glue them to the back of your felt pieces and you're ready for play on the refrigerator or even an old baking sheet if you want to make your play mobile. Now check out my friends Diana and Melin as they demonstrate how to do this flannel in story time. text of that rhyme, check the description box below. Looking for more fun with shapes? Try going on a shape scavenger hunt. Look for different shapes around your house. You can make your own list of shapes or you can try our worksheet. The link will be in the description below. Happy hunting! We hope you enjoyed this edition of Library Make. Stay tuned for more crafts to promote literacy and engage your child. See you in story time!